Hi, this is Corey Bogell with the National Weather Service in Caribou, and I'm going to cover the outlook for the winter of 2018-2019. Here's the official outlook from the Climate Prediction Center. Northern and eastern Maine are in an area where the odds are tilted toward above normal temperatures. This does not mean that there will not be any bitterly cold days, or even a more prolonged stretch of bitterly cold weather, but rather it means that the average temperature for the three-month period is forecast to likely be above the 30-year average. Here is the same outlook, this time for precipitation, and Maine is in an area where there are currently no strong climate signals that would point toward an unusually snowy or dry winter. A weak El Nino is expected late this fall and into the winter, and during a weak El Nino, it is possible that the Arctic Oscillation may allow for the production of very cold air in central and eastern Canada, and that may penetrate south into northern and eastern Maine at times. If we dig a little deeper now, let's take a look at what we're thinking locally, and our thoughts are based on our experience, a review of climate models, sea surface temperatures, the current state of El Nino, as well as other climate indices. Now, of course, our winters here in Maine are a little longer than just December through February, and we're expecting that for the five-month period of November through March, the temperatures will likely average close to normal. The greatest chance of above-average temperatures will be during the first half of the winter, and the best chance of colder-than-average temperatures will be during the second half of winter. We are expecting that precipitation will be near normal, with the greatest chance of above normal precipitation during that five month period of November through March across the Downeast region. We should point out though that confidence in the precipitation and snowfall forecasts is below average as the main storm track is expected to be south of our region much of the winter. If you do have any questions about the outlook, please feel free to contact me. We appreciate you watching the video and hope you enjoyed and be sure to check out our webpage for the latest weather updates this winter.